Volkswagen blazing across uh, the wings there and this is the first time that Mateus has been racing this aircraft so it's a brand new aircraft for him only the second ever to be racing in the Red Bull Air Race World Championship I expect this German to do well the 10 he's got to beat is a 114.2 he comes through at 218 so let's see how smooth he is coming through he's staying very level notice that plane did not deviate from the middle red stripe right there it's a blue gate the wind has to be hard horizontal. Now he's coming into the split knife. He gains some altitude. Look, wow. he's going up tilt. Can there be any advantage or disadvantage to his choice there? No, he messed that up. He got out of the shape. I think it was a gust of wind by the looks of it. That seemed to push him, so he had to react to it. Thankfully, he got into knife edge, so that's good enough. Let's see now. Can he make up the time coming through on the splits? Where is he? He's 0.29 seconds behind. That is outside where he needs to be. He's in third position. He needs to get at least second. As we're seeing him come back now into the start finish line. Now watch this play rotate. He's in the right hand turn. Bam! Up up left. Left knife edge. Back to a big sweeping right hand turn. Here could be our next split time. He was three tenths of a second behind, but now it's a beautiful turn. He's now three. is a 114.2 remember that figure 114.2 but at the look he's going to beat the wind oh, no he up in great level twice he goes to 114.9 he's outside oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. number 21 oh, yeah. Dolder, one minute 14.92 seconds two seconds in penalties for incorrect level on gate 11 holds you in fourth place <laughs> All right, take a look up at our screen right here. You oh, saw how his wings were not horizontal. They've got to be perfectly flat going through those blue gates. Obviously, just a slight deviation, and that's going to cost him a critical two sections and a guaranteed spot in our Super 8.